Hey everyone, let's continue more buyer's education with my walking and talking. And shout out to Ron Carpenter, I got the vest on again for you. So as you're looking at real estate, let's take a look at the difference between a buyer's market and a seller's market as a buyer and as the agent that represent you or represents you. So imagine in a seller's market, especially like February-ish, you would go to a house and you would probably see 15 or 20 people lined up outside, especially in an open house. Our job as agents wasn't necessarily to get you the best deal, it was just to get the offer in. You know, the house would come on the market and sometimes the house would be gone the next day or that day. So our job was to be there for you, have the contract written, make the offer strong, make sure that we could always get you in after making the offer, you know, even if you only had a two day inspection period, using the as is contract to your benefit. So it wasn't necessarily getting you the best deal. It was being as quick as possible, getting the offer in as fast as we can, protecting you with the contract. Now you skip to like a buyer's market. The buyer's market is completely opposite. It's not that we're you know, not aggressive and, and working fast. It's we're taking our time to really look at the house, make an offer that best suits you. What's the offer? Well, we're gonna, we're gonna have closing costs. We want this fixed. We're gonna use a long inspection time frame. Maybe we're gonna come back and renegotiate. This time, it isn't about rushing to get the offer in, but it's about getting you the best option on that house and maybe other houses as well. So you have to look at it like we're working in your best interest in both avenues, buyers and sellers. But in the seller's market, our best interest is just to get you a house, right? Just to get you a house. I, I got to get you a house. I got to put an offer in. We'll look at the house afterwards. Let us just get the strongest offer in to get it accepted. Where on the buyer's market, it's listen, I'm going to get you a phenomenal deal. I'm going to find out what's going on with this house. Why are they selling? Knowing that I'm going to get you a low offer, playing the game, right? Now, sellers, this is really important that you're watching this because you need an agent representing you that understands how to protect you in that market. So when I have buyers call me in a buyer's market, I am a beast and I will get you some great deals. I know how to play the game. I do it for myself. I'll lock you in a, I'll lock you in a good deal. And then you know what? I'll back out of the deal and get you a better deal. But when I'm representing a seller, I know agents like me. So I know how to play the game on both sides. So it's just really getting your client the best deal for them and knowing how to work the best for them. Um, we're going to go over how to get deals too. You know, like what I'll do probably tomorrow is walk around and show you how to get the best deal by door knocking, going to houses, using social media, especially in the buyer's market. So any questions you have, please reach out to me. I can, I'm getting eaten alive by these mosquitoes. I don't know if you see them. The best, best in the world. Any questions you have, we are continuing start to finish buyers 101.